of our Arsenal Van TV and I am with DT. DT, how are you feeling after that amazing victory? Uh, all right, actually. It's quite nice to see England get through early. It's nice to see us playing a bit of decent football. And, um, but let's not get carried away. Oh, OK, you're one of those ones. So yes. do you think that because it was Panama, they don't have the opportunity to go as far as we think if it was a better team? It's not that we can't go as far. It's just that we need to show precaution. I was like this with Arsenal. Don't get carried away too soon with results. Panama are a pub team, with all due respect. I know some teams back where I'm from that could probably give them a game. They are really poor. So let's just pull it into perspective. Um, we've got tougher tests to come. The biggest test for us in this World Cup will be first there against Belgium. If we can put in a good performance in that and get a result, then I might start thinking, OK, football's coming home. But at the moment, nothing's coming home. But I saw you dancing to football's coming home. Did you take off your shirt? No, no, I never took my shirt off. I weren't, I weren't getting that involved and start swinging it around. It's too early for that stuff yet. If we win the World Cup, shirt's coming off and it's getting swung around and stuff. But no, you have to, you know, you get caught in the moment. You've got to sing. It's your country. You're proud. But at the same time, you do have to just rein it in a little bit and understand it's Panama. And are you worried at all about England's defence? Because obviously Panama did yeah. get their first goal in the whole tournament against England. Yeah, that is the one thing that worries me because you can't switch off at this level. It looked like some were pressing, some were dropping. And if they do that against some of the better sides with some of the strikers that are in this tournament, they'll get punished and we won't have the comfortability of being 6-0 up, for instance. It could be 1-1 or 0-0 going into the last few minutes and that will be the goal that sends us out of the tournament, which is what has happened so many times. And lastly, how far do you think England can get DT? I said from the beginning that quarterfinals will be a good tournament for us because there's no expectation. I feel that the Euros in two years' time and then the World Cup in four years' time is what we really should be striving for because we've got a good set of young players. We've got a really good set of young players coming through behind this lot. Um, so anything now is a bonus. But as we go along and you watch some of these games at the moment, you do slowly start to believe. But I'll still say quarterfinals at the minute. Okay. Thank you so much, no DT. Worries, no problem.